If you don't have anything nice to say, don't say shit. It's that simple. I was taught that when I was a kid. Just don't say anything. Let me get my plate. Hey everyone, welcome back to another day. Today is May 28th. It is Tuesday, y'all. Yesterday was Memorial Day. And today is Sheila's birthday. Happy birthday, Sheila. Today we are going to take Sheila to a seafood boil place because Sheila does not eat cake, y'all. She never was a cake eater. She'd rather eat like fruit or food like a real meal before she eat a piece of cake um she does like cheesecake so i believe my husband's going to get her some cheesecake and then she did get like i think 35 to 40 dunkin donuts uh for her classmates today so she had a she do eat donuts so she did have a donut with her classmates but like she doesn't eat cake or anything so she requested a seafood boil so that's what we're going to be taking her soon y'all we're waiting for my husband to get off work and then we'll all be leaving out um but right now hey good birthday girl <laughs> but um yeah we're just waiting for a hubby to get home and we'll be heading out but um in the meantime i'm just going to tidy up my kitchen a little bit because it's looking a little a little rugged in here want to go enjoy some seafood because we all love seafood crab legs and all that and probably take her to get her a few things she did just get a brand new ipad that we let her open up last night at 12 o'clock and um because her old ipad had been cracked for years and she'd been begging for an ipad y'all and i just was like is she old enough to really be responsible for this ipad because i actually wanted to wing them off wing them off electronics for a while, especially because the summer's coming up. But um, she's an A student. She's awesome in school. I have no complaints. She bring home A's and B's. She's respectful. She's a little brat, but she's or a little brat. But overall, she's an awesome child. So we just went on and got her an iPad, y'all. And she was extremely happy. Did order her like the little keyboard case thing from off Amazon. That should be coming just to keep the iPad safe. Because one drop, sometimes it just cracks and it shatters and it's a done deal. So, um, yeah, we'll probably be going out a little later and move around a little bit with her. But she is 10 years old, y'all. Double digits. I can't believe she's 10. Our kids is growing up in the world, y'all. I'm starting to feel so old every day. Every day. But um, it's been like three days since I picked the camera up. So, we're going to do some vlogging today, y'all. So, stay tuned. Okay. Well, these are like, these are, look. These are big, these are big. These are the big ones. Which one smells better, the pink one? Or the, I like Is that the, the only flavors they have? I like the pink one better. I like the pink one better. They don't have it over here, this unless is, it's no, on the other side. This, those are the smaller one. Wait, oh, I see them. This one right here? This is the one you got me right here. 62. This is 40. I want to see 40. Yeah, I I want pink. Wait, what's this little Wait, right here? What does the brown one smell like? So in this crab place, y'all, you can write your name wherever you want in here. You can write whatever you want. Did you write it? Yeah. yeah. We went all the way over there where people can see it. Happy birthday, Sheila. How old are you today? Ten. Mommy, write your name behind you. Symphony. I see some fish in there. Ooh, look at this. <laughs> this is the, uh, this is the um, family por portrait or whatever it's called. What is that? Sheila, you excited? That's probably like a lion. <laughs> <laughs> right, she can bring oh, out like the crawfish. Like plates. Oh, okay. What is that, the crawfish? Yeah. Mm. Is it good? Yeah. Look at how he's mangling the, uh, <laughs> all right, Hey y'all, so this um, little vehicle that you see LJ riding in y'all was um, sent out to us. It's from a little company called Dimples. It's a marketing managing company. Um, they actually sell their um, 
cars and their vehicles and their motorcycles and everything they have on Walmart. But it's also their own separate store called Fun Sid Store. F-U-N-C-I-D. I'll put it right there so y'all can see it. But um, this is for like a three-year-old and the, up to like a three and an eight-year-old of age. And as y'all do know, LJ is eight. But LJ was actually a little too big for this, y'all. Um, he was fitting in here perfect. Like in the house, for some reason, it was riding smoothly. But when you take it outside... On the concrete, it was like it wasn't moving as smooth as it was supposed to be moving because I think his weight was taking over a little bit, y'all. But other than that, it was a really nice car, y'all. So the car has three speeds. It's Bluetooth, LED lights. It makes noise, plays music. Um, it's remote control, but also manageable without the controller. 24 volts, maximum speed. Um... Power type is electric. Maximum weight is 130 pounds. It has multiple colors for the kids, y'all. We just picked blue because, of course, he's a boy. So we were really thankful for you guys reaching out to us. Thank you all so much. I'll have everything linked in the description box for you guys if you want to check uh, it out for a nephew, a son, for a little brother. Um, LJ absolutely love it, but he's a little too big for it, so we'll be probably passing it on to my little baby nephew soon. But thank you. Hey, y'all. Uh, being all in the light in my kitchen, you literally can see all my grays. But they're staying there because at this point, I'm allergic to dyes. Um, last time I put a dye in my hair, my face was all the way out here, so I'm not even going to risk any more dyes. Although I did want to try the Adore. The Adore one is like a vegan one. Um, I might give it a try. I might. I'm still a little on the scare side, but I might. But... I got some chicken cooking, some baked beans, and I made some broccoli chicken rice. Um, I didn't eat lunch today because I was very busy today at work. Y'all, I didn't even have time to eat lunch. I'm making um, some food for the kids. Although the kids just had Wendy's. My brother-in-law got uh, the kids off the school bus for my husband and I, and he brought them back all some Wendy's. So they're pretty much cool for now, but they get hungry a little later. I'm not going to say a little later because it's already going on 7 p.m. So they might be cool for now. But they want like a piece of chicken or something a little later. They can have it. But your girl's about to get her grub on. Let me show y'all what I cook. Okay. I don't know why it's saying it's done. I'm going to go ahead and I already turned them and it said it was cool. Which means it was done like it started beeping. But I feel like I want to give this some more, um, some more crispiness. Although it do look so good. Oh my goodness. Look at this chicken, y'all. So good. But I want it to be a little bit more crispier than this. So come on, go ahead and start it over a little bit. Let me see. Mm, let's give it at least probably like five to seven more minutes because it shouldn't take that long. And then, but I got baked beans and that chicken broccoli rice y'all i just literally whipped this up within like less than 20 minutes like so i just literally uh i had took the chicken out last night uh but this morning before i went to work i had put it in the refrigerator so it could be like still chill but not still sitting in my sink so when i got off work all i did was came in here cut the tips off the chicken cleaned it real good Got the little feather things off of it. And then I um, seasoned it real good. Let it sit in the fridge for at least 10, no, I would say 20 minutes. Uh, talk to the kids. They don't have homework because we only have four more days left, y'all. We are almost done. We're at the finish line. We're at the finish line. But um, talk with the kids. Found out how their days was going. And I just went in here and tossed that chicken in the air fryer. Put my stuff on the stove and it only been cooking for like 20 minutes and it's almost done. I cannot wait to eat. My husband's on his way home from work. He's gonna bring me home some ice, something to drink, and we ran out of paper towels. So I just got the funniest comment on my last video. Well, not my last video, but a few videos back, somebody commented and said, 
I sound like I got two different accents and it's kind of hard to listen to me. I didn't know if I was supposed to laugh at that or take offense to that. Because I do always hear I have an accent. I just think I talk fast, y'all. I don't, I'm not, I don't have an accent. Like, I just talk fast sometimes and I be having to slow myself down with my talking. My father is the same way. He talked so fast you could barely understand what he was saying. But um, I'm like, why do people come on your videos and say negative shit? Like, it's not that serious. You can just click right off the video if it's annoying you that much that I have an accent that you can't figure out where I'm from and you just don't want to listen to it no more. Just click off the video. It's not that hard. Just bye-bye, exit yourself away. Why do people just feel like they have to say something negative? I don't understand social media nowadays. Like, I just don't. Like, I feel, if I feel like I'm watching something and something is just, like, irritating to me or it's, like, annoying, I would just get off the video. Because in my head, I'm thinking something, but I would never just say it, like, you know, like, it's ignorant. Sometimes it's, sometimes things just be kept to yourself. Some things just be ignorant. And a lot of people in this world just don't understand that. Like, if you don't have anything nice to say, don't say shit. It's that simple. I was taught that when I was a kid. Just don't say anything. Let me get my plate. I got my magical plate, y'all. Now, these baked beans are not my normal, usual baked beans. Normally, we got ground beef or even like ground turkey meat with our um, peppers in it. But this is like a simple baked bean. But they are so bomb. They are vegetarian, no pork, um, just brown sugar, a few seasonings. Oh my goodness, y'all. And I actually added the broccoli to this. Like, it was a cheddar broccoli rice, but it was the real, real tiny pieces of the broccoli where you really couldn't see it. So I ended up adding my own broccoli to it, and it is delicious, y'all. D Delicious. I'm gonna start a cooking channel, okay? Because if he ain't cooking, I'm cooking. And we'll be throwing down. It'd be the simplest stuff and we'll be throwing down. And it'd be so good, y'all. So good. But only thing I'm missing is a little bit of ranch. And I don't have no room for my ranch. So I might gotta get another bowl for that. But yeah, y'all, time to dig in. Hey guys, today is fun day. I got my fun day shirt on. My husband just dropped me off some Chick fil A. It's a busy day, so I'll be going outside to pet the animals and do all the fun stuff with the kids. So, I will see y'all later. Hello. Hello. Ooh, look at the Campbell. Hello. He is huge. Uh, we are going to make um, nachos today. The kids requested it, and they've been wanting it all week. So we found we want to make some because it's Friday. Have movie night. So I got the henna lime, and then we got nacho cheese. What else is in here? I forgot I ended up getting the kids a little, a little snickety snack. Then I got a jar of pickled jalapeno peppers. I got a chunky salsa because I didn't feel like making my own pico de gallo today. We're trying to do something quick. And then I got the um, queso white cheese. I also got uh, some ground meat. And we got another ground meat to add to that because that's a small pack. And I also got the other nacho cheese. Hold on, what else is in that bag right there? That's Hold on, who's growing that? He, he, I, I think he got it off somebody. And then we got somebody sugar cones. Like and then we got the Shrek Lay. Shredded lettuce. 
I'm missing something else, right? Or do I got everything? Yeah. Cookie and cream, soft ice cream. I don't know why I feel like I'm missing something, y'all. Uh, uh, and I'm going to finally try the Ollie Pop because Sheila requested mommy to try it. And she got the cream soda. So I heard this is, a, uh, it supports digestive health. And it's prebiotics, botanicals, plant fiber, a kind of soda. But it's supposed to be like the healthier soda, I guess. But I'll let you guys know how I like it. Because I've been hearing nothing but great things about the Olipop. So, yeah, we're about to go ahead and make these nachos, y'all. Because we are all starving. And I also think I'm going to add some black beans to ours. I hope I still got some beans. Let's see, y'all. Oh, why is there a knife up here? What is going on? Let me see. Let me see. No, that's not it. Oh, y'all. Is that the one? That's not it either. So, I just found these two beans, but I wanted the black beans. I think there might be a sneaky can up there. I just can't reach it, so I'll have my husband grab it, y'all. But fingers crossed, because I really want some black beans. If I don't got black beans, I might try these ones with it. But I kind of want some beans with my nachos. We'll see. All right, Maria's going to assemble her little taco salad. She's going to use the regular Doritos. zooming out like that. Maybe we should sweep this part up. Mommy. That looks so good already. That's it. That's all. That looks so good. Don't forget your sour cream. Your lettuce. Yeah. Your lettuce is going to be on top. Yeah. Alright, I'm done. Hey y'all, we just got back from Maria's all black banquet. Sneaker ball. Sneaker ball banquet, y'all. I ain't do no recording. I didn't Hold take up. Wait no pictures in there. We took pictures outside, but not inside. She got her awards, y'all. Go Moo Moo, go Moo Moo. It was Don't so live in there. We had four teams in there at one time. Um, I really couldn't even like pull my camera out and do a lot of recording, y'all. There was too much going on at the moment but we just got out of there it was from like 6 30 to 9 p.m i told my husband to be outside at 9 p.m because i'm running out of there and but um outfit. Let's look at my outfit, guys. we are gonna stand up and show y'all our outfit we got sheila in a dress y'all sheila don't even like wearing dresses but um it was each cheerleader could bring two people so um i thought about bringing sheila because my husband he was gonna stay with the boys so Sheila had her dress on. We all kind of look alike too, though, y'all. We got the same, like, well, we don't got the same dress on, but it look almost alike. But let me show y'all Maria. Uh, this is the uh, sneaker ball look for Maria's chair. We're just showing y'all what we had on. We got Sheila in the dress, y'all. Oh, I did already. And that's Maria. <laughs> <laughs> What's up, y'all? It's been a long time. I feel like I haven't recorded in so long, y'all. Um, today is Wednesday. Not May no more. It's Wednesday, May. I'm about to say May again. June. Um, June 5th? Yeah, today's June 5th, y'all. <laughs> 2024. 
And yesterday was our last day of work. Our last day of school. We are officially on summer break, y'all. June 4th was the last day for us. And when I tell y'all, I felt so good this morning waking up. I literally slept in until like 10 a.m. The kids even slept in. We were all over it at this point. Like, just getting up and going to that same place. We were over it. So, now we're able to just relax and enjoy a few months without anything. Like, have some family time. Work in school is exhausting. Like, it's exhausting. And you can't really do much because you're on a schedule. So, like, for instance, um, I'm backed up on my dental work. So, I got to finally make a dental appointment, y'all. I'm so happy about that. Um, they've been reaching out to me, and I made, like, two appointments and really couldn't even make them appointments because I had I had no more off days. Like, I used up all my off days because from the beginning of the school year, when I was at a whole different building, um, I used my days up. So, I didn't have no more days left. Also, with the kids, I finally can make them some appointments, y'all, because they were backed up on their dental work as well. So, well, they weren't really backed up. I would say like a month and a half because like last month, they did reach out to us and I had scheduled an appointment and forgot all about it. So, now I can really like make appointments for us, y'all. I also got to renew my driver's permit. Um, What else I got to do? Things about the house, y'all. It's just so much stuff that we can finally get done. And I'm super excited about it. Also, we got a family vacation plan. So, some things coming up, y'all. And I feel like I have not recorded in so long. Like, I think the last time I picked the camera up was fun day at my job. But I didn't even really record that much because I don't record that much when it's like a lot of kids you know, in the area, because I don't want to record no one's children, but I did record the animals, and they had, like, a petting zoo for the kids, so I did get a glimpse of that, um, yeah, I think we're just going to be relaxing for the rest of this week, um, my other job did, my other job did reach out to me and was asking, was I coming to work, so I might pick up some shifts here and there, um, depending on how I feel, but I'm really to just relax, I'm ready to just put my feet up, relax. My husband still do work, y'all. So, like, he was working um, all week. He worked this morning. He just got off, like, two hours ago. He at the grocery store right now. Grabs some stuff for our turkey burger. And, um, yeah, y'all, I'm just so happy to just finally be done. Um, the kids got the report card. Sheila made high on a roll again, y'all. High on a roll. Um... Bussy May on a roll. Maria, she almost made that on a roll, but she was just like two points off. Khalil, of course, is doing awesome in school, y'all. So the kids finished their grade level with a bang. Sheila's going to fifth grade. Maria's going to eighth grade. Khalil's going to ninth grade, y'all. High school. And LJ is going to third grade. So everyone is just doing great. Um... There's a few other things I wanted to say, but I, every time I come on the camera, I always seem to forget what I was about to say. But yeah, I just wanted to come on the camera because I haven't been on here probably like a whole week, y'all. Um, I have been watching, excuse me, um, my fellow YouTubers. Um, even though I don't comment all the time, I am watching. So, been catching up on that. Um, I'm just ready to just have a whole other chapter going on in our life right now y'all like i told y'all we in the process of buying a house and i can't wait for that that's gonna be a whole nother ball game make sure y'all are a, make sure y'all are subscribed and the bell is turned on so y'all can be notified when that video comes on y'all i do want to have a better schedule or routine for our videos because i'm all over the place posting videos i know i am um life have been life and like i've been saying but I'm finally able to just do more posting because I'm not currently going to be working. So that's a plus. Um, yeah, just stay tuned, y'all. And I'm about to get into making these turkey burgers in a minute because your girl is starving. 
Um, I'm going to go ahead and get another gym membership because I'm going to be hitting the gym up, y'all, like daily. Now that I have a lot of time. And, of course, I'm going to bring my girls with me just to have something for them to do because, you know, Maria's active with her sports and everything. Um, she's thinking about wanting to sign up for softball, so we've been looking into that. Um, what else? Sheila, she's got to stay active. I want her to stay active in the gym with me as well. Um, she's very much shy, so I don't know what she want to do for us, her sports, but she do want to sign up for piano lessons. Like, there's always a list of things to do, y'all. Maria, uh, just finished up her last cheer, um, season, y'all. Um, we're taking a little break from cheer, so we're just trying to figure out some things to get into. I think we're going to sign LJ up for football. And Khalil, we're going to figure out what Khalil can do. We got to figure some things out for these kids. Because um, they're no longer in the same summer camp they were in last year. That camp is done. So we're just trying to keep them busy. You know, keep them busy. And, of course, we're going to always be busy as well because that's just what it is. There's never no time to chill for parents. Never. Ever, y'all. So, yeah, let me get to making these turkey burgers because I haven't ate anything all day. And y'all know that I can talk y'all head off, and I don't want to do that right now. So, I will see y'all in a bit. Y'all, so I end up getting back from the grocery store. I got the turkey burgers on already. I cut up some tomatoes, some lettuce, some banana peppers because I love banana peppers in my uh, burger, y'all. But these pretzels, y'all probably already done with it and I'm already late. But these are so good, y'all. And I didn't even have some Nutella. Fire. Fire. My co-worker had some of these. So these, uh, these smoothie bowls. Asahi bowls. But these ones says smoothie, but... The ones I originally was going to get was from Aldi's, and they were called Asahi Bowls, and they had the, the granola O's and everything on it. But the grocery store I went to earlier only had these ones, and these were good. The girls had the berry ones, so I'm going to uh, try these ones, and if I like this, I'm going to get some more. And they were a little bigger from Aldi's. But this was from my local uh, grocery store, Giant Eagle. I didn't try it, but the girls tried it, and I seen that it had, like, uh, granola and coconut already mixed in it and everything. I brought some coconut flakes, but it already had coconut in here with the oats. But, um, yeah, I'm gonna let y'all know how these taste. The other ones from Oldies were actually are organic and, um, were a little bigger and it seemed like it had more oats and stuff on it. But I ended up grabbing some berries to go on mine. But it actually came with a lot of berries on top of this, so... I didn't have to do all that, but anyway, I ended up getting some more of this Ollie Pop, y'all. So good. And I'm about to enjoy this with my burger and my fries. And the kids ended up getting some macadamia cookies, y'all. They actually love these cookies. And yeah. How was the burger, babe? Five. Five. And I got some of this to drizzle on our acai bowls, but I don't know how that flavor would taste with this. But with the other berries, it might be better. Here got the turkey burger, y'all. I just got the turkey burger, lettuce, tomato, and banana pepper, and some seasoned crinkle fries. I didn't top it with no sauce or nothing yet, because I'm, I don't know if I want ketchup, A1 sauce, or barbecue sauce. With turkey burgers, you just gotta figure it out, because you know, turkey burgers, you gotta season to perfection. And you gotta have a good sauce because they don't have no flavor to them. Beef burgers is so easier to like, you know, hook up for real. And I don't like cheese on my burgers all like that. But I will eat cheese on my beef burgers, but not really my turkey burgers. I'm like, where y'all? But look at that. Mm, mm, mm. Mm, 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 mm. Bon appetit, baby. Hey y'all. Hey y'all. Hey y'all. Hey y'all. I don't know what he's doing right now. I know he's paying his phone bill. But we are on our way to Sam's Club. We have some grocery shopping to do, guys. Um, we really have no food in the house. So my husband was off today, and this was a perfect opportunity for us yes. to shop together. We only have one child with us going shopping. So yay. I'm going to third grade, and it's summertime now. Woo, 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 
and he had all A's on his report card. So, um, they send the kids home with like these thick package y'all for them to do throughout the summertime. And we're gonna put these kids to work because the package is actually a good packet. It's a packet for him for his third grade, a packet for Sheila for her fifth grade. And Maria even got one for eighth grade. So we're gonna put them to work when we uh, get back from grocery shopping. He can start like on two pages. The pack is like this thick, so he ain't gotta do the whole page in like three days. But it's a summer packet, which means you can get it done. And when we're finished with it, we're gonna take it back and show them that you completed your work, okay? Yeah. Cause they always pass them out, but a lot of kids don't complete them. So we're gonna make sure Mr. Uh, mm -hmm. Sharp and Mrs. Sickfree see that you completed their work. So they gave them to us? Yeah, why you got that hood on? Take the hood off. Oh. His hair is just a growing, y'all. Put your head down. It's just a growing. He didn't have no tails like that. Look at that. Yeah, y'all, we're on our way to Sam's Club and I might do a little grocery haul. I don't know how, how I might feel when I get back home, have to put all them groceries away, y'all. But, um, I guess I do got like a little list made. Sometimes I be like making a list so I'm not walking around in circles in the store. Um, yeah, but that's what we're on our way to, guys. All right, y'all, I just got back from Sam's Club. I'm gonna try to make this quick because some of these things need to go in the refrigerator and the freezer. But um, I ended up getting a big bag of the Dots Homestyle Seasoned Pretzels. Let me zoom out because it's acting like it's not. Hold on, y'all. It's not clear at all. Wipe this camera off. It was raining real hard. Okay, that's better. But we had a smaller bag of these and it went in one day. So I went and got a bigger one. And these are so good, y'all. If you haven't tried the seasoned ones, definitely give them a try. You're going to love them. I end up trying this spinach artichoke dip. Um... Never tried it before, so hopefully it's good. I will let you guys know how we like it. I got to grab some pita chips, though, because we don't have any of that. I grabbed a thing of butter. We got some uh, Atlantic cod, the boneless one. Um, we want to try this beef barbacoa. Um, it's just the meat, so we're going to try that out. And I also got some shrimp scampi. We got the pancake and sausage on the sticks, hot pockets for the kids. We just put one of these in the uh, microwave for Khalil, y'all. These is Khalil's favorite things. It's the croissants with the sausage and the egg. And then we also got the pepperoni pizzas. It's like three in a box. Um, these are new too. This is our first time trying these as well. It's a shredded white meat chicken with cheese, a quesadilla, and it got like some little sauce in here. I think it got sauce anyway, but it got 12 in here. And then my brother-in-law was telling us we should try these because these were good too. It's these little salmon bites. It's upside down, so let me start to turn it around for y'all. Salmon bites, we're gonna try those. And then we've been on these little acai bowls. This is the first time trying these ones. But the ones I got from my grocery store was a little smaller than these, so I think these is going to be cool too. But I really want to make my own because for just one of these boxes, it was like 11 and some change. So you better off getting your own little um, Asahi mix and put it in the blender, get your oats and all that to save a buck. And then I also got the kids some mandarin oranges, fruit cups. I also got two things of these smoothies. I got... 12 in here y'all the flavor is mango strawberry banana berry mix green boost and two of the same thing i got the smaller pieces for the kids just to pop in the oven we got some bananas i did get some of these uh flour tortillas to go for the the, uh, the beef meat i can never pronounce that meat what's it called barbacoa, barbacoa. we got the popcorn shrimp we got Rice Krispie Treats. We got the kids some ring pops. What else? We got a, a, a um, s'mores kit, y'all. We got a case of Arizona teas. We got some Pop-Tarts. 
buffalo chicken dip, barbecue sauce, a huge thing of hot sauce, ketchup, and then we get the kids these true fruit um, strawberries. They love these. Are they supposed to stay in the freezer? Yeah. Okay. And it's like only 90 calories too, which is crazy. They have other flavors like pineapple, blueberry. Do they? Yeah. Okay. We got some quick little Lunchables for Khalil. This is Khalil's favorite Lunchable, y'all. Or whoever want one, but really Khalil love these ones. We got the Nutri Grain Bars. I got the Ego Waffle things. We got two different variety pack of um, potato chips. We got Freezy Pops. And then we're going to... Oh, hold on. And then I also got those fruit cups down there as well. But we're going to try these Premier Protein Shakes, y'all. It's like something that you could just uh, drink for breakfast for real or something even before you work out because that's one thing we're going to be doing next week. Me and Sheila will be going to the gym and that's something we can take with us before we go But um, or just drink it when we get back, whatever. But I heard these is real good. I was going to get the chocolate ones, but I know they don't care too much for chocolate. So I went and got the vanilla, but I think I'm going to go ahead and still get the chocolate ones because I love like a chocolate milkshake. So, okay, let's go on the other side. We have two things of the orange juice, no pulp, lemonade, and two things of the pink lemonade. I also got some nectar rings in a bag. I love some nectar rings. Um, mixed fruit, pineapple, strawberry, peaches, and mango. I got meatballs, um, black beans, and then we got broccoli. And, and then I got the um, raspberry white tea. And then we also grabbed this macaroni and cheese to put in the oven. But we're going to grab like some lobster to put in it and hook it up ourselves, y'all. But don't sleep on our macaroni and cheese because it's really pretty good. So, yeah, that's it, y'all. Oh, hold on. And I also got the kids some animals, smoothie animals. Hey y'all, so I'm gonna go ahead and end the vlog here. I'm calling it a night. As you can tell, your girl is bummed out. Um, we went to Sam's Club. I went to the bank. I had to sit down and talk for like a little meeting. Um, it was a lot going on earlier, so I'm like tired. I also went to Walmart to get some things for the house, y'all. Um, yeah. So if you like this video, don't forget to give us a thumbs up, y'all. Thank you all so much for coming back, watching our videos. You guys don't understand how much it really means to us. We love you all so much. Thank you, thank you, thank you. If you're not already subscribed, go ahead and push that subscribe button, y'all. Turn on that bell so you don't miss any of our uploads. And we will see y'all in the next video, guys. Stay blessed.